Hi, I'm Diane Conklin with CompleteMarketingSystems.com. Do you have critics in your business? Do you have people who uh, don't like what you do, who don't agree with things that you say, who clients who have uh, canceled on your coaching problem, your coaching clients who have canceled prematurely or wanted to cancel? Do you have people who uh, sometimes don't say the nicest things about you? We would all hope in our business that that doesn't happen. The bottom line is, is that it does for all of us. And here's the challenge. As a business owner, as a small business owner, as an entrepreneur, you cannot let the critics, those few critics, because they are a few, you can't let those few critics, those few people who didn't have the best experience, right? You did everything you could do, and they were just one of those people. They, their expectation was different than, your, than, than what you were able to provide. Whatever it is, you can absolutely not let those few critics crush you, get you down, change the way you do business. Now, I'm not saying don't learn from these situations. You absolutely, positively have to learn from every situation that you're in if you did something wrong, if there was something you could have changed. And maybe the thing that you could have changed was on the very front end of not accepting that client to begin with. How many of us, we all do this in our business, we take people in our business or we say yes to things when we really should say no. But here's the point, and this has happened to me. This happened to me during the course of this, this year, actually. I had a couple situations, and you know how these things happen. They always seem to happen at the same time, right? I had a couple situations with a couple different people where they just weren't happy. Um, we had worked together for quite a period of time, six months or longer, and all of a sudden, they're not happy. Um, and sometimes it has to do with more of what's going on in their lives or in their business than it does with what you're doing. But here's the thing, it's very easy because we as, especially as entrepreneurs and small business owners, especially as coaches, right? We get involved in people's lives. We, we fall in love, if you will, with our people. We become friendly with our people, uh, with our clients. And I think that's a good thing. We let people into our lives and sometimes it backfires. Sometimes it's taken the wrong way. Sometimes it hurts our heart when these things happen. Here's what I don't want you to let happen. I don't want you when those things happen to let it affect how you feel about your business, how, it, it, how you let it feel about you, your self-esteem, your feelings of, of the fact that you're out there doing good things, that you're making a difference in people's lives. Because as a friend of mine pointed out to me, how long have you been in business, Diane? How many people have you worked with? And how many of these instances like this have you really had, right? So don't let the few critics that you have in your business or in your life get you down. Draw your business down. Take your energy down, right? You have to concentrate on the ones who love you, the ones that you are getting great results for, the ones who are coming back week after week, month after month, time after time and continuing to do things with you. Here's a great tip for you to, uh, to help you maybe a little bit when, when you do have those critics. Keep a book or a file if you want. I keep mine in a book. Um, but keep a file or a book or something of good comments that people say, right? It could be a tweet. It could be something on Facebook. It could be an email that somebody sent you. Um, keep a file of those, and when you're having those days, the card someone sent you out of the blue thanking you for something. Keep a file of those, and when those things happen, go to that file, go to that book, and just flip through it for a few minutes. It'll make a huge difference in how you begin to feel about not only yourself, but your business. I hope that was helpful for you. If you'd like more tips like this, more information about what we do, check us out, CompleteMarketingSystems.com. I'm Diane Conklin, hoping you have a a great day.